Hello, thank you for joining me on Yoga with Paige. Today it is a little chilly in Florida. This is basically our fall where I get to wear a little bit of a sweater and I thought it was a perfect, perfect excuse to kind of meditate with nature. So meditating on the sky. So this is will just be a quick little introduction and then I will turn my camera up to the sky and we can use this practice as anchoring ourselves. So a lot of times I tell you to anchor yourself with your breath, as in use your breath as a tool to draw you back into this moment in time. Use it as an anchor to draw you back in and hold yourself, ground yourself, connect. So instead of your breath, which you will obviously be utilizing throughout this meditation practice, I want you to try to anchor yourself with the sky. So basically, just gazing up at this video or your own sky. If you are able to get outside with me, I'm going to lay down on my back and show you the sky if you can't get outside yourself. But if you can, take your gaze up, not directly at the sun, remember, don't blind yourself, and use nature to draw you into the connectivity of all things. We are all connected, mind, body, and spirit. We're all connected to this earth, to other beings. And this can really help ground yourself into the moment and reduce stress and anxiety by realizing that everything is quite impermanent. Everything, time, continues on no matter what is going on no matter if you're having the best day of your life or the worst day of your life it will come to a close so don't let this thought stress you out let this thought invigorate you in the fact that you will never get this moment again so by finding yourself fully present and trying to draw energy from that you are actually Letting things go that no longer serve you. It can help you release grudges, release negative energy that you don't need to carry anymore. So as I flip you up to the sky, try and I'll continue to talk with you and meditate with you. But for these next about 10 minutes, just try to refocus yourself on the beauty that is nature, on the beauty that surrounds us every day. This is not a sunny day, it is a very cloudy day, but it is still beautiful in its own right, in its shade, and in its movement. I'm really enjoying seeing the clouds move, kind of allowing time to pass. Just notice what this brings up for you. Notice what this draws your attention to, your focus to. And whenever you are ready, find a nice, comfortable spot. Lie down if you want. Get comfortable. Gaze up at the sky. Make a little pillow with your hands, you know, like you used to do when you were a child, and make shapes out of the clouds. Release. Let go. Get comfortable. Let's have some fun. And just really come back home to ourselves with nature. So whenever you're ready, we can start. I have a little palm tree in the corner for you, a little piece of Florida. So lying down or sitting up, wherever you can feel the most comfortable, wherever you can ground down as you gaze up. Finding a place where you can get fully comfortable and immerse yourself in this short little meditation mindfulness practice. Maybe you can hear the birds in the background. You can also use sounds as your anchor. If your mind starts to drift or wander away, Use that sound, use your sight, find your senses, 
cultivate awareness through your senses. Letting your breath flow gently and softly. Finding perhaps some comfort in the idea that everything around you is breathing just the same. The animals, the creatures outside use their breath just like you. Even the trees breathe. Blades of grass softly swaying in the wind. The breath of the sky. Perhaps you can feel this breath sensation if you're outdoors. Or take this moment to draw inwards and connect to your own breath. Noticing the inhalations and exhalations. Each breath letting you know that you are alive and well. Each breath is a chance to begin again. You don't have to wait for tomorrow or next year to start something new to change the way you think, to start a new habit, to care for yourself better. You can begin on your next breath, sending loving energy to yourself on this inhale. releasing whatever you no longer need on your next exhale. that surrounds you, whether physically or on the screen, noticing the clouds as they drift by, continuously changing, evolving, transforming. If you're 
thoughts begin to drift, find your anchor, the one that resonates with you, pulling you back into the here and the now, the only place you ever need to be. Breathing fully into the belly and the chest. Allowing the passage of time. Just allowing it to unfold as it will. There's no need to manipulate it. Taking these next few breaths to come back to the physical sensations of your body, observing the contact points of your body and what surfaces they're touching, noticing textures, body parts in contact. turn, letting your mind drift away, letting the contents of your brain empty out for just a moment or two more, as you gaze at the serenity of the sky, the big, wide expanse. possibilities and outcomes are endless for you. Nothing is set in stone. Nothing is rigid. You can transform any thought, any behavior, any path you're on. Truly finding joy throughout this whole journey, this whole journey of change. Opening yourself up to the many facets, the many doors that this opens. Choosing which doors align with you in your present moment. Closing those doors if they don't feel right to you. Letting others choose their own door to open and close, 
allowing their journey to unfold in their own time. Coming back to the breath, the feeling once more, preparing to gently rise out of this meditation where you can wiggle fingers and toes, anything you need to help your body to wake up and carefully come back into your environment, wherever that may be. Taking one more big full breath together. Sealing in this mindful practice. Observing your energy. And I thank you so much for joining me on this little sky meditation today. And if you are interested to see some woodland friends I found before this meditation began, I will put a short little clip of some nice, beautiful birds that I was witnessing before this meditation. Otherwise, I look forward to the next time I see you, and I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful rest of your day. Thank you for joining me on Yoga with Paige.